It is a pleasure that you are with me again. I hope you and your pet are well. Today we will talk about the following. Ear tumors in dogs, symptoms, causes, and what to do. Let's start. If your dog has an ear tumor, it may be asymptomatic until it grows large enough to cause symptoms or until it becomes visible. Most ear tumors aren't cancerous, and some don't even need treatment unless they're causing problems or pain for your dog. Ear tumors are usually small lumps that grow on the skin, polyps, but they can also be a large mass in the ear or just a flat, discolored lesion. They can be black, purple, pink, white, or brown and can be filled with blood, oil, or pus, depending on the location. Ear canal tumors in dogs are more likely to be benign, non-cancerous, than malignant but should always be seen by a veterinary professional because even benign tumors can cause deafness and balance problems, among other complications, for your pet. 1. Symptoms of ear tumors in dogs. Side effects of tumors depend on the location of the tumor and its size. Some of the most frequent symptoms are Visible growth in the ear The dog shakes his head You stumble or fall due to lack of balance Tilt your head Ear swelling Scratches or rubs the ear. The dog whimpers or cries in pain when the ear is touched. Bad odor in the ear. Bloody or yellow discharge. Chronic ear infections. 2. Types of tumors. Most ear tumors are benign, not cancerous, but only a veterinary professional is qualified to tell the difference. There are several types of ear tumors that are as follows. Seroman gland tumor. Tumor of the inner ear tissue. Tumor of the middle ear tissue Tumor of the external ear tissue Bone tumor 3. Causes of ear tumors in dogs Experts aren't sure what causes ear tumors, but there are several risk factors. Dogs with large floppy ears, cocker spaniel, beagle, golden retriever, etc. History of multiple ear infections, external otitis, internal otitis, otitis media. Long-term inflammation of the ear canal repeated infestations of ear mites, thickening of the ear wax for any reason, usually unknown. 4. Diagnosis of ear tumors in dogs. To diagnose a tumor in your dog's ear, your veterinarian will need to perform a complete physical exam, including weight, blood pressure, temperature, reflexes, pupil reaction time, heart rate, respiratory rate, skin, and coat condition, and breath sounds. Tell the vet if your dog is taking any kind of medication, also, describe the symptoms you have noticed and how long they have been occurring. General diagnostic tests will be needed, which may include a complete blood count, chemistry analysis, blood gases, liver enzyme panel, and blood urea nitrogen. If possible, a detailed otoscopic examination of the affected ear will be done to check for damage or other tumors. Your dog will be sedated for this procedure, as well as for the x-rays that are needed to look at the structure of the inner ear. In addition, an ultrasound, MRI, or CT scan may be necessary for further examination. Finally, the vet will perform a fine needle aspiration or biopsy of the tumor to check for malignancy. 5. Treatment for ear tumors in dogs. Treatment depends on where it is and how big it is, but it usually involves surgery to remove the growth. Laser surgery is used if possible, as it is the safest option. However, in some cases, the vet may have to do a surgical division or total ablation of the ear canal, if there is extensive growth damage. The prognosis for ear tumors is good, but it depends on your dog's age, health, and location of the tumor. As long as the tumor is benign, there's no reason to think your pet will have lasting complications or a shortened lifespan. In some dogs, the tumor can grow back, but this is very rare. However, if you notice another growth on the ear, you should call your vet right away. Develop your dog's hidden intelligence to eliminate misbehavior and create the well-behaved, obedient pet of your dreams. Hit the instant access button below now. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, comment, and share the video. Thanks.